impressive. It looks bomb. Look at the char. Should have got it. Look at the char on that. Hello from the boardwalk. What's going on Diz fam tonight? We are gonna experience the boardwalk for the first time in many years. Now we live yeah, in the, the boardwalk. boardwalk capital of the world, New Jersey. We're gonna check out Orlando's boardwalk and then try the Flying Fish restaurant. Come join us as we review a lot of steak. <laughs> right off the bat, this boardwalk's nicer than the one we live at. Epcot is not the only place that has the walls up. So does the boardwalk. Across the water you have the Yacht and Beach Club. That's unbelievable. Swan and Dolphin. You got the Swan and Dolphin over here. The iconic boardwalk. And the iconic boardwalk, as Nicole just said. We're going to take a walk. We're going to look around. We have dinner reservations. We're really excited to try a flying fish. The boardwalk is about 10 steps away from Epcot if you've never been here. And there's Joe's Marvelous Margaritas. I think Nicole's probably going to stop and want to get one. I love that pizza window. People love this pizza window here. They say it's one of the best pizzas on the <laughs> Here's the Flying Fish restaurant we're going to be eating at soon. So we're just going to keep walking and exploring stuff as we do with you guys because we haven't been here in forever. There's not much like here. It's very quiet I'm noticing. Quiet. I mean everybody's in the parks but. Yeah. I thought there'd be a little bit more shopping. No they have their bikes. There's a Promenade Fine Art Gallery. Maybe we should go check that out. Yeah, sure. But the boardwalk, I kind of want to go inside the boardwalk resort just because they did a refurb and I haven't been in ever inside the boardwalk. We tried to book it like 10 times. Yeah, it's one of our cousin's DVC homes, but he never can get us in. It's always booked. I don't know how. Even 11 months out, it's always booked. But the rooms did just get refurbed. But I want to see the creepy chairs that they have in there. This is how Nicole and I should dress. Right? Maybe. Are these Disney paintings or are these just regular paintings? So if it's regular art, I really don't care. Oh no, it's Disney. We're gonna go in. It is the Festival of the Arts at Epcot right now, but... Well, look at that. On board. <laughs> Beautiful Cinderella paint. Oh, I can't afford any of this, obviously. <laughs> Nicole said she saw Lumiere. A giant Ariel. That Ariel. It's huge. We continue our trek down the boardwalk. It is a lot emptier than our boardwalk at home. <laughs> We walked over the bridge and here's the Swan and Dauphin. And this is beautiful. The flying fish, the boardwalk walk around was a lot shorter than we expected. I thought there'd be more here, but we're gonna go see if we can have a drink at the flying fish before dinner. Flying fish wasn't open, so we went to the boardwalk. And we're going to have ourselves a little champagne and wine. Cheers to you. Cheers. Beautiful view. Even better view right here. Is the hair, is the hair staying? <laughs> kind of. It doesn't matter. I love these. So we were also told that this place wakes up at night. We're here way too early. Right. And we were like, uh, it's a little quiet, which it makes sense. Like they, I think they have like performers out there, like jug, what are those things called that through the jugglers oh, i was gonna say jugglers but i didn't know if that was the right word well, so jugglers. they have them they have put the boardwalk games entertainment so i'm excited to see it come to life yeah and there's some music they said so mm -hmm. maybe when we get out of dinner we will see but we um yeah she said it's just starting to wake up so it's gonna 
All right, so we're walking through the boardwalk and that reminds us of Cape May County. Cape May, well, Cape May. Cape May, not Cape May yeah. County. But like Victorian Cape May, it's kind of where we grew up, so. Very Victorian. Old school. The menu on the wall here. The Tulane sea bass sounds so good. Well, we heard the best about steak. Yeah, like the um, strip steak. No octopus, because we did oct octopus last night. Yeah, that strip mm, steak sounds, sounds good. I don't know if I want to overindulge in appetizers, because you know, this won't be shown in the video, but we are doing the Magic Kingdom after this. Yeah, I don't want to get a snack. I'm getting a sweet treat in Magic Kingdom. Chandelier looks like bubbles with a nice high gloss ceiling. High gloss makes it look like a mirror. The hostess stand looks like a seashell. One thing Nicole loves about this place is the open kitchen. Oh, he's waving. Disney's big for open kitchens, though. The bar's super cool here. It's a bunch of wine bottles. The muscle isn't built the same way. It is kind of. Closer look at the chandelier here, you see a bunch of flying fish. I took my hat off because we're in a restaurant. But, um,. We both decided we're gonna go with the strip steak, the, uh, the charred, the char crusted New York strip. Everyone has raved about it online. I'm usually a filet guy, but that char crust looks so good. I can't wait to try it. But we're both getting it because we both want the steak. All right, change of plans. I'm getting the filet. I always say I'm not gonna get a filet, and I always get talked into a filet because filet's my favorite cut of meat. Nicole is going to get... I'm going to get the New York strip. I've been seeing so many videos on it, I'm definitely getting it. And we're getting the pork belly for an appetizer, so yeah. we will be right back. Oh, we got some drinks, of course. So. Bread's coming, too. Oh, oh, I got to take the video of the bread. So, you know, bread we're service. bread connoisseurs. We're like bread people, so... The best part of dinner has arrived. The bread. bread Made service. here in Orlando. Pork belly app looks amazing. Looks delicious. It, looks it does look like a smoother, chewier texture, like buttery, not like a crispy pork belly, which people are used to. I just cut that with a fork. Looks beautiful. Let me get my piece ready. Is it good? Do you like it? What Super are you tender. Are you gonna mix this with all? A little apple flavor. Really good. Mm. Super buttery, smooth, rich, delicious. You can tell that they dry each just for a while. Here is the filet. That looks unbelievable. But this, I think, looks better. Look at that strip. The New York strip is crusted. It looks bomb. Look at the char. Should have got it. Look at the char. Nicole's going to try it. Phenomenal. Just one bite you already know, it's phenomenal. Phenomenal. The char on the steak, this is amazing. 10 10 recommend. Alright, I'm gonna try my filet. Super, super tender. Wait, it's like butter. Mine on camera. It's like butter. The truffle's amazing. 
the sauce that it's in is unbelievable. Mm. It's just like perfect. I'm gonna try Nicole's on camera. I love this kind of sauce. Hollandaise sauce. This is better. I'm going strip steak. Wow. I'm a filet guy. That strip steak is 10 of 10. Oh, yeah. Great filet. That strip steak's unbelievable. I'm gonna eat half first. Well, the plate will show you the review. Nicole literally, Nicole literally threw in a towel. Uh, yeah. I, I just finished her steak for her. Oof. So we just left and it was an amazing meal at the Flying Fish. Delicious. So cool. It is very costly. It's one of the more expensive yeah. restaurants. It's, but it's it says signature good. dining, right? Yes. Yeah. Signature dining. Super no dining tasty. plan here. Um, no dining plan, but you do get an annual pass. It's gonna, oh, mm -hmm. you get, there is a dining plan. It counts as two. Oh, two table it counts services. Two table yeah. services. Delicious though. Highly recommend. Um, ten of ten on the steak. Mm -hmm. Her her strip steak was amazing. The service was excellent. We definitely recommend Flying Fish. And if you guys want to see more reviews, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And we will see you next time for some more reviews. Do you need help getting a Disney dining or experience reservation? If so, you need to set up a magical alert. Magical Alerts is a service that searches available dining and experience reservations 24-7 and automatically sends you a text once a reservation is available. They are super quick and you just click the link in the text to go to the Disney site and reserve your spot. Try them out today at MagicalAlerts.com. Use the promo code DS2024 when you sign up and you'll get one free alert added to your account.